What the heck is going on? Designers, if you want to make these types of logos that use these fluid organic connections between circles, Bill Gardner refers to these as the liquid bridge, then there's a really fun way to do it in Illustrator. Now you could just take two circles and overlap them a bit, then unite them using the Pathfinder window, and with the direct selection tool, just round off these two corners to create that curvy joint. But you can't tweak that design to refine it without starting over each time. So the super duper fun, neat way to do it is to first select both our circles and press Command or Control 8 to make a compound path. Next, bring up the appearance panel and add an offset path to your circles. But when you do, change the joins to round. Now we're gonna do that again. Add an offset path, effects path, offset path. And we're gonna apply another instance of this effect. So just click apply new effect. This time, we're gonna add a negative value, switch our joins to round again. And our liquid blob is starting to take shape. Now you're gonna to wanna to double click into this object to move that smaller circle, but that doesn't work because this is a compound path. So instead with our direct selection tool A, I'm gonna option or alt click a path point on that circle, which selects all joining path points at once. And that's a really handy shortcut if you didn't know it. And now watch what happens when you move it, ooh. And I can even option or alt click to duplicate more shapes and scale them with the free transform tool E and just go nuts. And if you need to refine those offset path settings, you can always just come back over to your appearance panel and edit them here.